Ah, it's you again. <laughs> a little better, thanks. Oh, and we owe it all to you. That's great! Seems like getting rid of the meteorites is doing the trick! Traveler! Your arrival is most fortuitous. Clearly, my noble ambition to protect the souls of this wretched world compelled you to seek me once more. Now, prepare to depart. For we are soon to meet with an envoy of mine further afield. Envoy? You mean... a, a diplomat? Ah, yes. L let me fill you in here. Someone brought a message from the Dawn Winery saying that a lady there by the name of Adeland invites you to meet with her as honored guests of the winery. Oh, we know Adeland. She's the head housemaid there, right? Ah, it seems that you and Adeland are already acquainted then. Then, it is my great honor to join you. Hey, so... Can you really understand that princess when she's talking? Because Paimon can't seem to understand a single word. All right, all right. My dear friends, it is time to move out. Paimon hopes Adeline has made some tasty snacks to welcome her honored guests with. <laughs> Welcome to the Dawn Winery, dear adventurers. I'm Adeline, the head housemaid, and it is I who invited you all here. Thanks for the invite! You are Adeline? <laughs> Splendid. I am delighted to grant you the honor of joining me for afternoon tea. Dearest Adeline, on behalf of Her Majesty Miss Fischl, the Princess de Varotalong, and I, mine Fräulein's humble servant, thank you for inviting us. <sighs> Would you cut to the chase already? Your titles are so wordy it takes way too long to introduce yourselves. My goodness, an adventurer of such distinguished status. My pale-faced proselyte, how dare you interrupt a diplomat of the royal court in the middle of his speech? In fact, one of our employees here at the Dawn Winery, a Mr. Hartman, fell victim to the meteorite incident in Springvale. I hear that you are the ones who disposed of the meteorites. Thanks to you, Mr. Hartman is now awake. We are in your debt. It is merely common courtesy that I should invite you over for tea. This aside, there is a separate matter which I should like to enlist your help with. Ah, oh, you're too kind, Adeline. We're really just doing what any other adventurers would have done. You may now kneel before your princessin. 
and make effusive display of your thanks for the favor that I have generously shown to thee in thy winery ken. <sighs> Take heart, my dear servants, for the glory of my majesty will flash eternal in the Vale of Springdom. Oz, hold off on the translation. Paimon wants to have a try this time. Um, so what she's trying to say is, y you're welcome? I applaud your powers of comprehension, my dear Paimon. You decipher mine Fräulein's royal utterances with remarkable ease. The business of the winery reaches not only to all of Mondstadt, but to all the corners of Lua, too. Some of our workers do regular deliveries back and forth between the two regions, a single round trip taking several days in total. Two of our delivery staff were due back yesterday, but as of this moment, I still have no contact from them at all. I worry that they became trapped somewhere when the meteorite struck. The winery is short-staffed at present, and I cannot afford to look for them myself. As audacious as it may be, all I can do is ask you for assistance. Okie dokie, don't you worry, Adeline. We're expert people finders. Oh, wonderful. I suggest you begin by asking around at Stonegate. All delivery staff pass through there on their return from Liyue. There were two carts in total and the workers' names are Fritz and Ben. Two Mondstadt carts, both loaded up with wine. Have you seen them? Hmm. Sorry, I don't think so. Okay then, we'll keep asking around.
Kronstadt merchants traveling through here? You know, the ones with all the wine? Oh, I am afraid I have very poor eyesight. I'm not the right person to ask. Oh, okay then. For a couple of carts, originally from Mondstadt. Have you seen them? From Mondstadt, you say? You know, I think I did see one pass through here. Really? Which way did it go? Let me think. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, it was going towards Mondstadt. Thanks, mister! Now to chase down that cart! scared me half to death. Thanks. <sighs> so, which one are you? Ben or Fritz? Hmm? Uh, I'm Ben. How did you know my name? Yeah, we're your official search party. Per Adeline's wishes, we came here specifically to find you and ensure your well-being. Ah, uh, I suppose she must have started worrying because of the long delay. I'm afraid that Fritz's cart is stranded out on the main road between Dihua Marsh and Stone Gate. It got hit by a meteorite. <clears throat> anyway, we agreed that I'd finish the delivery and then bring someone back to fetch him. I just hadn't factored in the part about getting ambushed by monsters along the way. <sighs> I really hope Fritz is okay. With me getting delayed here, the poor guy's been out there a long time. Now, I keep worrying that the same thing will have happened to him. Can you guys go bring him to safety? Between Stonegate and Dihua Marsh, right? Leave it. 